Why hello you amazing beautiful people and welcome back to another reaction video. We had to do this. We had to do this. This is something that Toho Animation literally just dropped at the moment I'm recording this video and that is the special music video to the Free Ren opening. And honestly, before I even press play, I've got to say Free Ren in my opinion is like just the perfect form of media. It's just stunning. I honestly think it is the single most flawless season to anything I've ever watched. I, I think it is just freaking perfect. I can't think of a single thing I'd change. I do think it is perfect. And I recommend it to everybody. Even if you're not a fan of anime, I recommend it to people. I think it's amazing. So I think with our free rend journey ending and us waiting for the announcement of season two, because we know it's coming, that this would be a really cool video to sort of round us out. So I'm gonna stop talking. Make sure you guys like the video. Make sure you subscribe for more. Press that subscribe button. And let's jump into my first time ever reaction to the Toho Animation special music video for the Free Ren opening. Have I reacted to the full version of this opening yet? Because this is the second opening, right? This isn't opening number one. Have I? This is this is the second opening, right? I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy, right? I don't think I've done a. I don't think I've. I don't think I've done. No, I haven't. I haven't. That's kind of cool. So this is a genuine first time reaction, actually, to the full version. <laughs> I didn't realize it was this opening. Mm. This song is so good, man. It's a really good opening. This is a really, really good opening. And I feel like it suits Free Ren's atmosphere so brilliantly. And the thing that, that I really loved about this anime was every time, by the way, in, in case you're wondering, I'm sucking on a cough sweet. Um, my throat's still really bad, so I'm just, just wondering what I'm doing. Um, the thing I found really cool about like what it's showcasing here is when Free Ren first went to like the Magical Academy and started to want to take the test along with the fern, I was a little bit disappointed. And like that turn in the story, because I was like, oh, they're on this really cool journey. I don't want them stopping off for somewhere and dedicating so many episodes to just like this arc that we're on here. Especially when they took Stark completely out of the story as well, and I was missing our boy. And yet, when I had my doubts and reservations, it was just after watching like just 10 minutes of like the first, like the first part of this new arc, I realized it didn't matter what Free Ren did. It didn't matter where Fern, Stark, and Free Ren went. Honestly, it is just their journey, and you could have an episode of them just chilling around the bottom of a tree chatting, and you would still love this anime. It's just so good. And this is my first time reacting to this opening, by the way. Oh, it's so good. Can I just pause and rewind here? This sneaky motherfucker right here. This sneaky motherfucker. That reveal at the end. That he wasn't even there. That he was miles away. That reveal. So cool. So cool. And the way he's like, oh my god, she's actually really good. It's such a cool little reveal. Bro's balls were huge. Took the entire test without ever turning up. This anime is so good. I'm really hoping we see. I don't think we will. That's the thing with Free Ren. I don't think we'll see any more of Sari. Is that how I say her name? I don't think we'll see any more of her. 
I reckon she's actually just gone. Because the anime doesn't seem to, like, dwell too heavily on characters it introduces. It does these incredible, like, introductions of new characters, builds their backstory flawlessly, and brings us to become very attached to them. But then they'll just be disregarded, and we just move on. And it's amazing how it does that, it makes you feel for characters that aren't main characters, that aren't we aren't going to see a lot of. And even if they're in it for, like, one episode, when that episode ends, you become attached to that character. And I wouldn't be surprised if most of the characters we saw at the end of season two, including our crazy elf friend, we just never see again. Also, the way Free Ren looks at that, like, pendant with that smile, I, I love that. Because it's like, it's like she just never even cared about getting, like, be, like becoming a, a first-class mage. Got the bass coming in here. Only Free Ren could literally go, like, take one of the tests. It's a terrifying dungeon. And she's like, oh, let's have some fun. Let's explore the whole dungeon. Such a good opening. I can't remember the name of that, that woman. I forgot her name, but one of my favorite entries to like the final test when she walks in and he's like, so. What do you think? What did you think when you first saw me? Um, I thought you looked really cute and tiny. And if she's just like, you pass. <laughs> like, fucking best thing to say ever it was amazing. Oh, I want to watch it all again. It's such a, it's such a fucking great show. Should we just watch it all again? Should we watch it all again? Should I just do, should I just turn this channel into a fucking free run reaction channel? Should we just want to watch it all again? My word, I feel so sorry for people who haven't seen this anime yet, because it is so fucking great. And just like watching this again, it's just making me realize how great it is. And this is the second half of the show. It's not even showcasing all the brilliance of the first half. Fights, the character development, the music. The lyrics of this are so brilliant too. And the fact that that face, that terrifying face, even without arms, even with like limbless standing there, free rends, freaking like clone of herself last time she used that was 80 years ago against the demon king i wonder if we'll ever get to see that fight against the demon king will we ever get to see the demon king fight was that a young flame What a beautiful ending to that song. Even like, I love the lyrics that she says like, right, let's let's calm this song down. And then the instrumental literally just stops, like literally stops. 
and then you just have these pure freaking blissful vocals there to lead us out of that song. That was so good. My word. <laughs> that was so good. What is the name of this singer? What is the name of this singer? Free Ran Opening 2. What's the name of the singer? What's the name of the singer? Haru Sunny. So the song's called Sunny. Uh, by Yor Yoru? Yoru? Yorushika? Yorushika? Have I reacted to Yorushika before? Probably, right? Yorushika. I've got to say, Yorushika needs to go on the first take. That ending of the pure freaking like vocal bliss that we got there. Can you imagine that on a first take performance? Like live and just like pure vocals. It would be stunning to listen to. I really would love to hear this opening live. I think it would be awesome live. I really would love to check it out. I can't believe I haven't reacted to the full version of this yet. I don't know why I haven't. You would have thought I would have done it ages ago. I honestly don't know why I haven't, but I'm glad that Toho uh, released this, um, Toho Animation, because it's like, like, like it's this. if I'm going to react to the freaking um, oh, full version of the opening for the first time, this feels like a pretty good way to do it. Not only did it have the lyrics, but it also we also got to relive the ending and the wrap up of season one of Free Ren. And I feel like this is a really cool way to actually check out the full version for the first time. So kind of glad I didn't. I did it by accident, but I'm actually really glad I didn't now because I feel like this is a really cool way to check it out for the first time. I feel like Toho Animation did a really good job on this. Like a really, really, really good job on this. And the way they did all this, the way they did all of this was was amazing. And she's showcasing the final journeys of Free Ren with this absolutely fantastic opening theme as well. And the music around Free Ren was amazing. From the first opening, even though the first opening felt kind of out of place in the world of Free Ren, I still think the first opening was an amazing song. The ending, of course, by Millet is just a brilliant brilliant ending even like the revamped version for the second half was so good it's exactly the same but and like with little touches here and there oh my word and that is such a brilliant opening the lyrics matching the anime so perfectly the song again the beautiful sort of style to it and the art history it is a beautiful freaking opening song and it's perfectly suited for free ren <sighs> free ren my opinion of this anime will always be Season one, I don't know, season two might be bad, it might be great, it might, like, we'll have to wait and see. But the fact that it set the bar so high with season one, who knows what season two is going to be like. But I will say this right now, season one of Free Rem might be the most flawless season of anything I've ever watched. I can't think of a single season of any show, TV or anime, that I've ever seen in my life that is as perfectly put together as Free Ren season one is. Like even the greatest shows of all time, Breaking Bad, Game of Thrones, like the seasons have flaws and, and holes and, and issues with them. Even though I love them, they're not perfect. But honestly, I think Free Ren is as close to perfect as you can get. If someone said to me, you can change anything you want about Free Ren, what would you change? I don't know how to answer that question. But if someone said that to me about other shows, I would have answers. But I don't have an answer to that question with Free Ren. In my opinion, it's perfect. I think season one is just absolutely spectacular. I feel like anyone who hasn't seen it is missing out so heavily on just a brilliant anime journey. And anyone who doesn't like anime is missing out on this as well. Because I feel like if you don't like, I feel like Free Ren could become the new poster child to introduce people to the world of anime. It's not too heavy on like anime cliches and concepts that someone who's new to anime might be turned off by it. It is just beautiful. I really feel like you could get anyone into anime and use Free Ren as the gateway. Attack on Titan's always been my go-to like recommendation, but I feel like in the same way Attack on Titan's got all the action and epicness that like something like Game of Thrones might have and you might be able to get someone into the world of anime f with that. I feel like Free Ren can be the, the tails to the heads of Attack on Titan when you flip that coin. And if you want to get someone into anime, you can flip a coin, you can find out what sort of style they like, and you can recommend either Attack on Titan or Free Ren. And I feel like with those two together, you can just suck someone into this world. I can't wait for season two. I cannot wait. If season two is just as good as season one, then we will be on to one of the perfect forms of entertainment anyone's ever seen on this planet. If this show can keep 
keep its momentum as good as it is until it finishes, I don't see anything ever competing with it. Crazy. That's not me saying Free Run is my number one favorite anime of all time or favorite TV show, but that is me acknowledging how incredible it is. Because it bloody well is. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this reaction. Please like the video, subscribe for more. Let me know what else you'd like me to react to in that comment section down below. Also, is Toho a freaking video game as well? That was bugging me a little bit. Link in the description to this video. Again, subscribe, press subscribe. And as always, my friends, you will see me in the next video.